the Pixel 2 XL, the Galaxy Note 8. This one has two cameras, this just one. But does one outdo two or two outdo one? My journey comparing these pocket photography wizards took me across land and sea and proved both phones were skillful enough to capture the world around me. My quest started at the Ferry Building in San Francisco, home to skateboarders, Gandhi, and pornographic ice cream. Both phones took appealing pictures, but for different reasons. Photos taken with the Note 8 had boosted contrast and saturation, mimicking a frame of film from a dramatic movie. Pictures of the Pixel 2 XL had a pure clinical beauty with expertly rendered detail and highlights. This photo taken with the Note 8's telephoto lens shows off the beautiful oranges and yellows of a sunset behind the Golden Gate Bridge. The Pixel 2 XL's standard angle lens rendered the same scene with cooler tones and more detail in the waves. I headed back to land for some games and to test out portrait mode, which gives photos an artistic, blurry background. On the Note 8, it's called Live Focus. The Pixel 2 XL portraits had better detail and better focus fall off from people's heads to the background. Note 8 portraits looked warmer and rendered a more pleasing blurry background. Whether on a boat or a cable car or uh, just taking pictures of pets, the Note 8's two times optical zoom allowed me to get closer to my subject without diminishing image quality. The Pixel 2 XL's single rear camera only has digital zoom, which can produce softer looking images with more color noise. Then there's video. The Note 8's video stabilization is good, but the Pixel 2 XL's fusion stabilization is the best I've seen on any phone. Yeah, go ahead and film your best Goodfellas Steadicam shot imitation. Video image quality from both phones was good, but a bit of a letdown compared to how nice photos are, especially video shot in low light. The Note 8 and Pixel 2 XL are capable of jaw-dropping 240 frames per second slow motion. Unfortunately, it's at a not quite so jaw-dropping 720p resolution. However, the Pixel 2 XL can shoot 120 frames per second at 1080p, producing dramatic slow motion without sacrificing resolution. Also worth mentioning, the Note 8 can record time lapses and has built-in Snapchat-like stickers. The Pixel 2 XL's front-facing camera lets you take portrait mode photos, and they look amazing. Look, trying to determine which phone has the best camera is complicated. If you like to zoom and want a gorgeous display to view your photos, the Note 8 is the way to go. If you want the best pictures, the steadiest video, and excellent portrait mode selfies, go for the Pixel 2 XL.